okay so next we are setting up the product and services which is the hosting packages itself let's go right ahead set up product services and then product services so first we want to set up the new group which is the only thing we can do right now product group I'm going to name this coding packages and I'm going to use the Ajax card here and available payment gateways which is PayPal for the moment we have already set that up so I'm going to check this um, and I won't hide it so that's it and save changes okay so we have the group set up now we can create our first hosting package create a new product product name discover so we are gonna go from top to bottom and from left to right we have details pricing module settings custom fields configurable options upgrades free domain other than the links so let's go right ahead product type is hosting account product group is coding packages product name is discover product description I'm going to use a simple one learn how to code and publish your work instant for the world to enjoy that's pretty simple welcome email we are going to set the hosting account welcome email and we are going to customize the email templates later on okay so require a domain yes it is required to have a domain name stock control no we don't have any stock control so we're gonna leave that unchecked sort order zero this is the first one on the order form so i'm gonna have that still at zero apply tax everything is tax included so i won't check that i won't hide this product we want people to see this product retired no this is not a retired product so everything is good to go here so before you go to the right side on the tab here you it's good to keep saving the changes so once you're done with the tab you, you save it and then you go to the next tab which is pricing this is a unique one in the hosting industry i guess but this is a good approach it's a one-time 25 dollar fee we want to be able to provide the service for people to keep learning how to code whenever they have the time to continue or pick up where they left before so we don't want to charge monthly payment for people to just start to learn in the other hand we we don't want to give this product for free as well because when when we provide this for free people will abuse the service for sure especially people who wants to put up phishing web pages like pretending to be bank websites paypal websites to scam people out of their money they look for free hosting providers especially those which do not put advertisement on the web pages being served so that is one of the main reason we don't want to provide these services for free to keep the membership clean and to keep only the the particular targeted segment of people who really really wants to learn how to code not just play around because they have to spend actually a 25 dollar account opening fees which is reasonably cheap leave the other as minus one so i'm gonna do minus one here because this is a month uh, one-time payment only 
okay allow multiple quantities no we don't want to allow multiple just one per person recurring cycles limit we don't have any recurring so leave that zero auto terminate or fixed term no leave that zero termination email well we can put a termination email later on we can set up our own termination email just in case somebody abuse this account and they put up something that is not supposed to be put up we have to terminate we can put a termination email later on and we can assign it here we can do that under email templates prorata billing it is not relevant because we are doing a one-time payment only prorata date is not relevant charge next month is not relevant we will discuss about this in the next hosting package which is the super power one so that's pricing i'm going to save this module settings module name is cpanel i am going to save changes server group pick the one that we already set in the server settings before now the whm or web host manager package name you can grab this from your web host manager which we are going to do right now log in here and we can look for packages packages and um, edit package so this is the package name hg club underscore discover underscore super power so this is the one that another one that i was setting up but we are not going to use that one so hg club discover for now and then another one hg club super and then space power hg club oh it's already there i'm gonna pick it there so all the rest of the settings i'm going to ignore because we have already set up the whole details inside the web host manager when we create the package as you can see this is already predefined all the resources so we don't have to redo the whole thing here just put in the web host manager package name and you are good to go now we want to automatically set up the product as soon as payment is received then the next day we can double check what the order is about and we can um, screen it further so for now i want to automatically set up the product as soon as the first payment is received so i'm going to save the changes here so that's module settings the next one is custom fields we won't be asking for our own custom questions you can add here your own custom questions with which will show up on the sign up form for example you can ask how did you find us and then you can provide your um, answer which is is just a text box or a password or a drop down and so forth but we want to keep it as straightforward as possible so for now we won't be adding this okay configurable options since we have not set this up it's blank so we're going to skip this one as well upgrades later after we set up the super power package we can choose that this package can upgrade to the super power package for now it's blank now free domain we want to offer a free domain but we want to offer a sub domain not the the main domain itself is not going to be free so we won't be providing a free domain names for people who purchase the hosting package but if you want to do so you can set this up free okay free for um if they pay maybe annually or which domain um, top level domain you want to give out and so forth now let's go ahead and go to the other tab 
this is other settings we don't use affiliate so skip that skip this now sub domain options this is the one that we want to use for this particular project we are going to offer dot clubcoder.com for free so somebody can buy their own name dot clubcoder.com when they get the hosting packages and it's going to be free Offerages billing this is not relevant and all of this is not relevant so i'm gonna leave that and go to links here this is the links for this particular product for example if you want to put a button anywhere on your facebook pages or on your twitter tweets or any other uh, form of links in your email messages you can use these links and it will go directly to the uh, shopping cart in our website so that's pretty much it i'm going to save the changes i'm going to go back to product list the next step is i am going to create the second product so next let's set up the super power package so i'm going to duplicate product here and simply name it super power hit continue so everything is set up let's see product type is good product group coding packages product name is super power learn how to code and publish your work instantly for the world to enjoy with the super power package you can set up up to five projects at once the hosting account email is the same it requires a domain and everything else is the same here so i'm going to leave it as it is save this go to the next tab pricing now this one is a recurring one recurring not a one-time payment so the one time or monthly i am going to set up a five dollars a month here five dollars a month and and keep the rest is negative one which is disabled i'm um, not really i want to make it annually and have it a discount two months free if they pay annually for fifty dollars and that's pretty much it so recurring cycle limits allow multiple quantities no for sure recurring cycle limits to limit this product to only recur a fixed number of times now we we don't have a limit there so i'm gonna leave it zero auto terminate after a number of uh, days it's going to auto terminate for example for free trials or time limited products which is a cool future but we won't be doing that termination email we will set that up later on we don't want to use prorata billing or date and this all may confuse people so i'm just going to leave that as it is module settings now we have to change this to super power that's it and uh, re uh, leave the rest of the settings as it is now next uh, this part is the same automatically set up the product as soon as the payment is received custom fields we don't have any custom fields we don't have any configurable options here upgrades we can go to the discover package to change the up uh, to set the upgrades no free domains other yes we want to offer the subdomain as well so that's pretty much it links are the same now i'm going to save 
changes here and go back to the product list and we have to make some modification in the discover package here as we want a, a one-time payment i'm going to go to pricing and just notice it so this is actually a monthly of 25 dollars a month which is wrong set this up to minus one and this one a set of fee of 25 dollars so if i save the changes now it should be good so now we want to go to the upgrades and people can upgrade to super power package from the discover package so you simply highlight it by clicking on it and save the changes so that's pretty much it we are good to go now next we are going to uh, go to the order form and see how it looks and we are going to customize the order form and then we are going to do a test order all throughout the way and see how it goes okay see you on the next course